hardening of heart. I get compassion fatigue because I'm human. Give me, I, the best way for me to describe that compassion fatigue during the course of the year is this. My parents used to have this refrigerator. Wasn't self-defrosting. So that means, and those of you who are uh, probably don't have this experience, that means every few months the freezer would get caked with ice. And it would get so caked with ice that you could hardly put one of those flat TV dinners in there. That's how long we let it go. <laughs> and that caking of ice to get it out, you had to get actually a pick and a hammer or hot water and you kept throwing it in there to break that ice up and you would have your freezer box back. For me, that illustrates what happens to me during the course of the year. My heart gets hardened to the world, to injustice, and I need the hot water and the pickaxe to get that hardening away from my refrigerator, my bad old non-defrosting, self-defrosting freezer. And Advent is like anticipating and hopeful and allowing the Christ child's birth to break that hardening of heart away so that you can be and reflect the love, the justice, the servant of that Christ child. It's about letting the spirit, the spirit in each other, break again into that hardened heart, into our hearts and our minds in anticipation and hope, so that the meaning of the Christ child, his life is present, is alive, and spilling from us into the reality of the world today.